Hey, what's up everyone? John here from testprepinsight.com. And today I'm gonna to be reviewing the MCAT prep course from Blueprint. I'm gonna cover how the Blueprint MCAT course works, what features you get, cost comparison, and of course, what I like and what I don't like about it. So if you're ready, we got a lot to cover. Let's hit it. All right, so to kick things off, I just wanna mention up front here that since I'll just be sort of limited to talking about the high level points in this video, if you find you need more detail at any point, you can always check out our full detailed written review over on our website. An easy way to get there is just to Google Test Prep Insight Blueprint MCAT Review. It's a quick way to find it. Okay, so let's start this review off by quickly covering Blueprint's pricing to help set the stage. And as you might know, Blueprint has two different course types. their self-paced course and live online version, both of which vary in price depending on the length of access. The self-paced courses range from $2,000 up to $2,700, and the live online version goes from $2,600 up to $3,500. Overall, Blueprint is on the pricier side among MCAT prep providers, though not outrageously high. Kaplan, Altius, and Princeton Review are all in the same ballpark and within a couple hundred bucks. Though I would note that Blueprint does frequently run sales and special promotions on their MCAT courses, and a lot of times you can find these packages for a few hundred bucks off. So do be sure to check for coupon codes before buying. In fact, I'll do my best to keep that description down below the video screen updated with the most current discount codes that might be out there. So make sure to check out that text down there and save yourself some coin if you decide to go with Blueprint. Okay, so with a little price comparison out of the way, let's dive into a breakdown of this Blueprint course and the features that you get. And let's start with how it works from a high level. In other words, how it's structured. So everything sort of revolves around your study plan, which is the central component of your Blueprint dashboard. When you first register with Blueprint, they have you enter a bunch of info about your exam date, weekly studying availability, dates to be blacked out, your target score, and some other info. And when you're done entering all this info, the program optimizes a personalized study plan for you, which is in calendar form and tells you exactly what to study and when between the day you sign up and exam day. Depending on how far out your exam is, you're generally gonna have three to five assignments per day to complete. And the assignments you're given on your study calendar are generally either gonna be learning modules, problem sets from your AAMC materials, or mock exams, with the learning modules being far and away the most common. In total, the Blueprint course has 190 of these learning modules with 160 covering hard content review and 30 focusing on strategy, reasoning, and other soft skills. And let's talk about those learning modules. Basically, each one covers a subtopic tested on the MCAT and it bundles a series of video lessons with quizzes, drills, strategies, and passages. And basically you tackle each subtopic as a standalone task, working your way through the exercises in the module until you master it and test out of it. And without getting into too much detail in this overview, I'll just say that the video lessons are what make these learning modules. Each module is centered around one of these primary video lessons and they are awesome. They have fantastic production value and are a great way to deliver content review. But more on this in a minute when I talk about my thoughts. And then of course, as I mentioned, the other two components of the Blueprint study plan are your practice sets from your AAMC materials and full length practice exams. And I think that's pretty self-explanatory, so I won't go into too much detail about it, but essentially around your learning modules, Blueprint weaves in strategically placed practice sets and exams to make sure you're getting adequate practice work and conditioning yourself for the actual test. Now, to this point, that pretty much describes the self-paced online course from Blueprint. If you're wondering about the live version of the course, it's essentially the same with, of course, live classes being the foundation of the program. The live classes will basically cover the material from a few different learning modules in one session and generally go into greater depth in the video lessons. But either way, whether you go with the live class version of the course or the self-paced package, there's a few other features that I quickly want to run down. At any point, you can jump into the QBank and create a custom quiz based on question type, difficulty, number of questions, and some other factors within their filters. There's over 4,000 questions in the QBank, and a lot of the problems even come with video solutions, not just text explanations, which are super useful. Likewise, you can always opt to take a full-length practice exam, though between all the learning modules, live classes, if you go that route, QBank sets, office hours, and mock exams that are already on your calendar, I'm not sure how many tests you're gonna do on your own. For sure a few, but likely not a bunch. And I actually just noted one other feature that I wanna cover, the office hours. So roughly five times per week, Blueprint will host these two hour study sessions where an instructor runs a deep dive into a particular subtopic tested on the MCAT. They'll zero in on the nitty gritty of the subject, answer questions and work practice problems. And occasionally some sessions are just open Q and A to talk about any subject or anything MCAT related generally. And lastly, the final feature worth noting is Blueprint set of analytics. Under the analytics tab on the navigation bar, you can get a bunch of useful data on your performance. These analytics even get into your last second answer changing habits, weaknesses by question subtype, and even more detailed analysis. And that's about it. I mean, there's a couple other resources with Blueprint like PDF materials from old office hour sessions that are kinda helpful, 
but what I just covered are the main components of the Blueprint course and where you'll spend 98% of your time. And I know I covered that really fast, so if you do want to see a more detailed breakdown of exactly how this course plays out, be sure to check out that full detailed review that I mentioned, I'll have it linked down below in the description. I have more detail over there so you can get a better feel for what to expect. Okay, so now that I've covered what the Blueprint course is like and pricing, let's get into what I like and what I don't like about Blueprint and whether I think it's worth it. And let's start with the things that I really like. And my first course highlight is the learning modules. In short, I just found the learning modules to be a really effective means of delivering content review. The learning modules are short, hyper-focused, and easy to digest. They each cover a narrow subtopic and you hammer that area with a video lesson, drills, and a quiz to make sure you understand. Honestly, I think this integrated approach allows for more effective content retention as you essentially get the same material in a variety of ways all in one sitting, reinforcing your understanding of the content. And then, number two, which sort of goes hand in hand with my first point, the video lessons. As I mentioned a couple minutes ago, the video lessons are simply awesome. They are without a doubt the best in the MCAT prep space that I've seen. They're engaging, incredibly well designed, and just plain easy to watch. Every video features a Blueprint instructor teaching in front of a green screen, and as they provide their lesson, the screen around them populates with graphics, illustrations, and cool little cartoon animations of chemical processes and physical systems. Plus, the text and notes of the actual material that you need to memorize appear as well. Essentially, the production value and overall quality of these video lessons cannot be overstated. Okay, my third pro is the personalized study planner. So like I covered early in this video, your study plan is really important to your daily study. It's essentially your roadmap for what to study and when. I personally like this because it's tailored to your personal schedule, it's nice because it has this pretty rainbow color which is great for OCD brains like mine, and it's interactive so you can freely move your daily tasks around by dragging and dropping them as you need to. Just a really helpful feature. And then, number four for me is the live classes. I love Blueprint's live MCAT classes. For one, they're integrated with the online course program and materials and really build on these primary resources. Plus, I found their approach to teaching live sessions to be super useful. Blueprint uses a cool two-instructor approach and this back and forth dynamic makes for some really engaging classes. With some MCAT courses, you get one lecture, all class, every class, and it just gets a little old hearing them drone on. But this dual instructor approach adds a cool element and I think juices up the content retention level. Now, if there is one knock with Blueprint's live class version, it's the amount of hours. With Blueprint, you only get 40 hours of live class time, whereas with other companies, you get more. For example, Altius provides a minimum of 60 hours and Princeton Review offers 120 hours. It's just something to keep in mind, though I do love the quality here. And lastly, number five, just a quick shout out for Blueprint's live office hours. I just thought these sessions were incredibly helpful. The Blueprint instructors aren't afraid to get into the weeds on topics and are very open to answering questions, so they add a lot of value. Okay, so that covers what I like. Now let's get to the things that I wasn't crazy about. But before I get to that, I should mention that every single month here at Test Prep Insight, we actually give away a free prep course to one lucky person. It's super simple to enter. Everyone is eligible to enter to win. I'll put all the details down below in the description, but just know, it takes like 10 seconds to enter and hey, you never know, you could win a free Blueprint MCAT course. Anyway, the negatives, and I have two of them with Blueprint, starting with the problem explanations. To put it simply, we just found Blueprint's problem explanations to be a little thin, particularly when compared to other MCAT prep companies. To be clear, I'm not talking about the video breakdowns that accompany problems occasionally. Those are awesome. I'm talking about the written answer solutions. Blueprint's do an all right job, but I would like to see them bulk up some of these explanations with more detail. And the second con I found revolves around the prep books. So when you sign up with Blueprint, they ship you a set of six hard copy prep books. And I don't really have any beef with the books directly. They provide substantive reviews of the primary MCAT subjects and contain end of chapter practice problems and strategies, which I found to be well written, but my bigger issue is that they're not that well integrated into the coursework. They just seem to be more of an afterthought. I just think Blueprint could have done a better job weaving these books and reading assignments into the main course. And that about does it for the detail in this review, so let's get to my final verdict. Is Blueprint MCAT prep worth it? Honestly, after reviewing around 10 different MCAT courses at this point, Blueprint is and remains our number one rated course. Altogether, their study materials and course design are just rock solid. You get the awesome content review coverage from Next Step Test Prep, who Blueprint acquired a couple years ago, plus all of Blueprint's insane video production quality, smart study schedules, and the algorithms that drive their performance analytics. It's basically the perfect marriage. I do have a couple minor complaints about prep book integration and problem explanation thoroughness, but all in all, Blueprint is an awesome course and easily gets some of the highest marks that we've doled out. And that's all I've got for you. I hope this review was helpful and you learned a little something. If so, make sure to return the favor by subscribing to our channel, liking this video, and dropping us a quick comment below. That'd really be appreciated. And again, if you want to see that full detailed written review that I mentioned earlier in this video, 
hop on over to our website, testprepinsight.com, or check out the rest of the videos on our YouTube channel. We have a ton of great content out there. But as always, thanks for watching, best of luck, and I'll see you in the next one.